Are you going to shoot something right. now? Baker and the Ma- <laughs> Baker and Molasses at the movies. Yeah, Baker and Molasses. We're uh, at Mars <laughs> Studio. We're about to record Gus's show at the movies with Gus yes. Molasses. Yes, and, and, and Roxy's such a great guest host, and, and I love when she's here. Hot off the press, Independent Spirit Awards, thanks to Harrison who, who posted them. Um, I'm pleased to say Robert Pattinson. You're talking about nominations. Yes. Best lead. Really? Okay. Willem, best supporting, but at least he's in there. You know but what? It's kind I, of interesting. I think here's what here. That's a great point. I get Robert because he was sort of the main, but yeah. I think Willem Dafoe is. So you know what? You know what's really this is positioning now. Nice yeah. is that if the Oscars take that lead and give him a supporting yeah. nod, oh, take the lead and it. give him supporting. See what it. I did? Yeah. That's what the, that's how he sneaks in and they gets had some his some Really interesting nominations. In fact, the guy yeah, from tell Luke's me because. Best supporting, the, the the young man, yeah, Harrison. Could have even been lead. Actually. Okay, Loose is an interesting film. He's got like a couple names, Junior. Right? Yeah, he's a Harrison Edward. I think it's Harrison. A couple Jun- other things I was excited about. Uh, best first film, Diane, which I love. Right, Mary Kay Place. We're D- talking about her tonight. Diane is Diane. The Big Chill. Right, she's still in there. Look Unbelievable, at her. small little film. I loved, I loved it. it. Yeah, it was great. See, and I mean, the I, Mustang. I, uh, I mean, come on, finally. And that guy was actually nominated. Gussie's for, Picks. That guy was nominated for Best Lead, Matthew Schoenheit. Oh, yeah, it's fabulous. That's awesome. It's fabulous. I was Great excited act. about that. I had to sell it to my class. Yeah. They, they didn't believe me. They gave a little faith. And I was really glad Elizabeth Moss, her smell. I'm telling you, you got to did not see watch that. it. You can see it on your TV. Elizabeth Moss from um, Mad Men? Yes. I, I met her. She was really sweet. She plays this rock star who's sort of out of control. But oh, the really? movie is so cool. It's like in like... I didn't see it. It's it, in like five Was videos. it Netflix? Yeah. Her smell? Is it on? Yeah, you can find it. It okay. actually played to Hollywood 11 for like a week. So tell me... Now, I have not been able to get through... So, but go through your rewards. Okay. Do you have some more? more? Uh, those were the main like excitements. So what about picture? Or do they do that? Or is this... They the, did have picture. And to be honest, it was kind of weird. Like I can't remember. I didn't write them. Oh, before. okay. That's all right. Um... But it was a strange... But Defoe's nominated in Pattinson for The Lighthouse, yeah. so which is a looking, film you love and I love. Yeah, I was looking for my people. Okay, and do, then, what uh, about our friend Joker? Nothing. Nothing for Joker. I didn't see anything. Well, they just have to have the money then from the billion dollars they yeah, made. And I wonder if they think, well, they're going to get it somewhere else. So Joker is growing on me as a performance thing. and uh, yeah. uh, Definitely he's going to get an Oscar nomination. Yeah, he, One he, way or the other. Yeah, he's going to get nominated for sure. But he wasn't on there. He'll probably win, too. But Independent Spirit, they like to go sideways a little bit, which I like, right? Hence the Independent. Yes. No, I like it. Yeah. They're the they're anti-Oscar thing. Right. So... Right. So other than that, you had a couple of movies you wanted to chat about this week. Well, did, did you, you see Pain and Glory? You did. Pain and Glory, I did see. I saw Pedro Amaldivar. I'm a big fan. Um, I'm not as big a fan as I am of, let's say, Agsfar Farhadi, who... Um, oh, yeah, yeah. Um, oh, God. What's, the separation? What's, 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 it's a separation, the past, about yeah. Ellie. Oh. Uh, of course, the last film that everybody knows, which I yes. love. It. And Pen- Penelope Cruz, that's why I brought that up. Oh, yeah, yeah. Penelope Cruz is in this as well. And I did a talk on this at Burns Court. And I, and I don't know if I missed something. I don't want to do a spoil because you're big and not, you're good about not giving spoiler alerts. Right. But the mother in this, the way this movie set up, right. <laughs> in terms of the la- you know, the, the, you knew I'm talking about how they end the film. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The mom in this, and I think I can dance around this, the mom in this, casting-wise, that's the real mother, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. The real mother is, is, is Penelope Cruz, right? Right. And that's him as a little boy, right? Right. So then when the real mother grows up, right. it looks like nothing like the real mother. <laughs> it doesn't. Nothing. You're right. Nothing. You couldn't find someone that looks Nothing. Sort of like that. You're right. <laughs> I, went, I went insane. Span the globe. You could find uh, get my mom to do it. My mom looks like Penelope Cruz. My mom was like dead ringer for Penelope. Yeah, That's yeah. like my mom's family. No, I went. I, I agree. I with lost you. my. Now I. There's a part of the narrative that maybe he's seen her in a different, better light. His okay. mother. All right. Penelope Cruz. Right. His real mother was the mother. And right. then he's like doing the film of that. You the, know what I'm talking the about? The Halcyon days of my mom look better than the real mom? I don't know. Yes. Yeah. 
but but do they look at anything like it? No, Ray's I agree with you. Yeah, and it's, I, it's casting I the, women cast the films scope better. Of it was just too large. I get it was almost like his autobiography. Fine. Did you like the film? Did you go? You didn't love it though. I wasn't moved. You weren't moved. I loved parts of it, and I mean. I just wasn't moved as what well. I mean, as much as the hype, that's the thing. Yeah, when I wasn't. Some of these movies that come a great out, point. the hype is so huge, you just go in going, this is going to wow me. Antonio Banderas, I just expected to be blown over. And oh, I, I love the man. He's gorgeous. I thought he was good, though. Oh, he's great. I th- but he's compa- much better in his language. I know. When you're you always like, don't compare it to other movies, but you can't help it at Oscars race. You know, you can't not. Well, the looking. aforementioned film that I just talked about, which is everybody knows, I I, oh I absolutely God. adored that film, and I I had to argue with people that are you know oh it's in, much more layered, far more range in Banderas and Banderas and yes. and the the real couple. There's just an energy there. Yes, I agree. Um, I like that f- film much better than this film. Yeah, I agree. Which I although was there was a lot there in this film. It's just too too big of a scope, yeah. I think. But I love parts of it. Yeah. I liked how his mother was sort of disappointed in him because yes. of his lifestyle. Yes. And but I think he should have zeroed in on more part of it. But it so. doesn't land for you. Right. Yeah, I agree. Yeah. How about did you see Jojo Rabbit? I was at Jojo Rabbit last night. Long week, a lot of movies. And you know, and I and I'm sitting, I'm going for the ride for fifteen, twenty minutes. I have a problem. Maybe it's consciously or subconsciously or subconsciously somewhere. When you're doing a film about Nazis, yeah, it's not that funny. I agree. You really got to go somewhere for me to, um, and, and it, it's almost too. And so I, 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 felt, I did a couple nods and fell asleep, and I was like, all right, all right what's it? And then I said, you know what? I don't need this right now. No. And I'll watch it, yeah. and there's maybe there's some good value in it. But it's not where I want to go. No, I totally agree. It yeah. wasn't funny. Uh, yeah, it wasn't I, funny to me. And Ta- Taki Watiti, is that yeah, the guy? Yeah, I he's don't. the one who plays Hitler. Yeah, dude, get off the screen! Like a oh, little, you just need subtle. Don't, yeah, like great, great dictator. I compared that in my blog. Oh my god, that was subtle. It was subtle. Yeah, that's that's a whole other league, though. We got You're it. talking about one of the greatest artists yeah. of all time in the history of the world. Yeah, Chaplin. I didn't feel you know, for Scarlet, and I love her, but I didn't, I'm like, what is she? Who is yeah, she? Yeah, I, I gave up on it, to be honest with you. I just couldn't do it after watching so many good films. Yeah, I agree. So yeah. we're sitting here live with Mars Vision, yeah. Mark Palmer. He's checking the They're set. We're doing a podcast soon. right now. No, it's good. Mark Palmer's the dude. <laughs> we can, yeah, we You're can it. He, he make, guys, if you need to shoot some video, this is a little shameless plug. You go 630, don't you? Yeah, we're good. I saw, I saw Mark doing a... Uh, yeah, drone. we're Maybe? shooting Santa Claus. He's we're not over. actually shooting him physically. We're going to sh- film him. Yeah, don't do that. We're, yeah, because we want the kids to get their presents. <laughs> <laughs> um, so uh, yeah, okay, you know so what? We agree on some of those films. Like, yeah, we well, expected. No, I, I revisited our film that you like a lot, and I like a lot, and there was a violent thing in it, yes. and I and I, I almost think maybe I need to check my violence barometer at the door because I, I don't want to be that person that is I'm a big First Amendment guy so you have a right to do it I saw Parasite again I did too and I'm going to tell you the second time I saw Joker I liked Joker more my friend actually said because I said well, yeah. okay be honest I go what was more violent Joker or Parasite he said Parasite and I thought I sort of agreed <laughs> only because I counted seconds. yeah but you know what though Parasite's a better movie I agree because it's better yeah, it's storytelling. Just, yeah, but but at the same time, as I say that, it's better. It's in my opinion. That's still Joker is a hell of a film. It's a hell it of a really ride. Is. The cinematography in that is really good. I mean, both films, but still, I mean, I don't like the message necessarily. The glamour of the guy, right? Guy, and I don't like the 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 anti protest BS at the end. I don't. But no. that's their thing, right? But the storytelling in in Parasite is just blows you away. It is good. And it isn't, you know, again, what's worried me again, same thing with my review of Joker. It's like, I'm talking to all these folks that are lifelong learning. They're in their 60s, 70s, 80s. Yeah, it's not too violent. No, <laughs> it's, like, it's like everybody's like become, it it's not too mind. violent. It blows my mind. I mean, I cringe. I was like watching and going, oh, I don't want to watch that. 
and we kind of did a spoiler thing, which is kind of bad. But it's it. Oh no, I think. You know, it's two movies. I still think it's. I felt it's bad that I didn't warn Jay and me about the scene. It's like, shut your eyes. Oh, did they see it? The young, our young friends, our, our young proteges, Mia, who shoots our film, our show tonight. I just felt like I was hurting their. Minds. Were they fa- were they fair to the audience, the screenwriter and the director? When you throw that big a curveball, like you could. Oh, for parents? Yeah, you? we're sitting in a studio right now, and if you you have to look, there's this gargantuan blob of a guy, and I can't even describe him. But if you just like pop somebody into the like third act of the film, yeah, it's a surprise. But does it work? Well, they tie it all up really but nicely. If you're knowledgeable, like I actually thought from viewing the trailer, because that's all I did. Yeah, I thought it was going to be the family, the wealthy family that was violent. That it might look pretty that they're all rich, but they're oh. violent because of the you know the way the trailer. The trailer yeah. was great. Yeah, because. Tra- I hate trailers to begin with. Yeah, this trailer was good because you didn't know what was. They're going usually to not done that well. There, there's some I expected t- violence just based on the trailer, so I wasn't surprised. Well, the poster too gives it away too. The yeah. poster has the. Uh, yeah. It, it, but it's but quite the acting in quite it a ride off the charts. But too. The, the script is a great script too. I like so the foreshadowing, and I thought the homage to Rear Window, which is Hitchcockian. Oh, They're looking yeah. through windows, yeah, 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 front windows and rear windows. I loved all that. And the levels, the basement, the sub basement. Yeah. I mean, that's great. Heavy. Yeah. Good film. It's yeah. gonna. I think it might be the best picture foreign language film. Yeah. I think. Yeah, it definitely got the spirit independent. Yeah, it's 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 really rocking the. Uh, I think it's gonna make a. It, not, m- one of my classes didn't want to see Joker. I'm gonna. I hope this sticks around. I want to. They think I punished him by sending him to this film. I said because they didn't really care for Harriet. Right? Did you see Harriet? No. And Harriet's this wonderful superhero woman. Oh, I know. I, who's doing all these superhero things, and they're like, people are bored with the, a story that's more than like if you don't believe the narrative, they go, "Oh, there's no way she did that. She made it look easy." That's right. the problem with her. She's got a great life story. Cause yeah, I taught it. I mean, yeah, you taught her. I mean, yeah. I didn't really know that she she went back and forth Seventh and back and forth. Seventh grade was like all Civil War stuff, which um, I taught. So I but knew. what a woman! Oh. And she might be the twenty dollar bill. She might be the first woman on a twenty dollar bill. <laughs> did you hear they wanted to cast Julia Roberts as? <laughs> oh no! Are we going there? <laughs> Are you serious? Oh my God! Oh, that's God. Hollywood, man. Wow, that's crazy. That's Hollywood, where they go. Oh yeah, let's get Julia Roberts. <laughs> that's good. <laughs> Put her in. I'm going to say it. Blackface. Oh, you know, they're not even. You know, get Whoopi, Whoopi or right. Joy Behar. Harriet was. Did they tell the story right? Yeah, I, I, I was pleased with it. I, I didn't. Good. I didn't think that it's linear storytelling. It's not. It's not. Uh, it's not the ride that um, Joker and. Uh, <laughs> it's not the ride that uh, Parasite is. Right. But I like a good. You know. Kind of so interesting, but she was just such a woman that it's history and it's beautiful. Yeah, I mean, and, and was shot beautifully, and it's like I don't know what more you could do. Right. You know, you know, some people say, well, it's, it looks like a TV production, and they said it looks like something you'd see on PBS. I go, God forbid, it's got such low production <laughs> values on PBS. Right, because it's, Sorry. It's educational. <laughs> right. That was a little shot. Right. Was, so anyway, no, it was good. It, right, well, I, I liked it a lot. We should probably get ready for your show. Yes, let's do a show. show. Big shoe. Yeah, we got all these shoe. awards here, and we got to, our number one fan is over there. I'm gonna take a picture of that and put on our. Yeah, I think you should. I think that's there. our next guest, okay, Job of the right. Hut, and his Weight Watchers. Um, <laughs> and his. Oh, friend. that's the new green plan and from. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Thanks, Gus. All right. Thank you, Rox. All right. Bye.